love Japan. Japan is I just, been there. oh, you need to go. I think because I'm a little bit of a nerd, love my video games, love watching movies. And then you, you go to Japan and one, the food there is next level. And it's I not just like, yeah, it's not just like sushi. It, it, there's so much more mm. to it. And um, we had this one experience when we were out there in, in Japan. And uh, luckily we were with the tourism board. So there was, um, you know, a translator there. But when we went out to the to the water where the fishery the fisheries are and they literally bring the fish in fresh and then there's an auction and they're just in japanese getting buying the fish and then they shove it into the back of their van take it to the restaurant for lunch now you would think that the fish is caught fresh that morning and then by the time you get to lunch that's when you eat your food mm. no they understand that everyone is going out to eat lunch so that's why they literally from 11 o'clock they buy the food and then it's cooked up for you at 12. That's called like farm to table wow. right there. And we followed the truck to the restaurant and then we had the man cook us sushi. Such an amazing experience. And of course the culture there is just next level. It's it's literally like being in an, in an anime when you're there. You, or do you know, my sister said that. Yeah. She stopped there for a few days on the way to America and she wasn't even looking forward to it. She said it was one of the highlights of the trip because she said it was... It wasn't just a different country. It was a different world. Yeah. Like you walked into another world. And everyone's you know? so polite there. And, you know, it, you yeah, it's you go to Japan and it's it's next level. Definitely skip your Bali trip. Go to Japan. I watched your videos in oh, Japan. Oh, thank you. Yeah, especially when you went to, I think it was the old war memorials like in Hiroshima and stuff. One of the best war museums I've yeah, ever been to. I saw because that. I've been to Pearl Harbor and you, I've you, been there. you see the American mm. side of it. But then you go to Hiroshima and that museum, yes, millions of people were affected by this atomic bomb, but the way that they do it is they pick someone, they pick a little child and they make say that's Make it personal. Make it personal, this little child coming home from school and then having to run to the to the river because they're just melting from this thing. And that <sighs> just, that hits you because sometimes as the human race, you can't comprehend the million. But if someone just picks a story, 